привіт, дівчата і хлопці. Hello to all Ukrainians and also to all people over the world. I decided to make this video to everybody who are seeking for job in the UK, especially to Ukrainians. Все буде добре, тримаємося, все буде Україна. So after my last video about uh, working in school, I got uh, some questions. Uh, first of all, one of the girl asked me if uh, we need uh, police check uh, for working as a teacher assistant. I would tell yes, agencies and schools require police check or DBS. So this piece of paper look like this certification that you did not crime in the UK. But I would like to tell that you should not uh, scare of these documents. You can get this uh, for one or two weeks uh, just easily. <coughs> Your agency apply for this document and they give you a link. And through this link, you can apply for your DBS check. For DBS check, you need to pay about 47 pounds. But don't worry, if you go to job center and ask job center to cover this money, they can give you your money back for uh, DBS. You just need to provide them some confirmation that you start to work at school and uh, agency require DBS check. After you received your DBS check, during 30 days you need to register it on the update servers. I will uh, uh, write you the link to update servers. You just uh, uh, write there are the number of your certificates and they ask you pay again. It costs uh, 13 pounds. It's not much. I pay it by myself. So in such way your certificates will be registered online. In this way you can work not only with un one agency, you can apply for other ag another agency or you can apply uh, for work at school by yourself and they just check your uh, certificates online. So don't forget to do it during the month. Uh, some agencies ask to provide police check from Ukraine. Of course, uh, it's very difficult to do because uh, there are is war in Ukraine, so you can explore, explain that it's difficult to do it. Or I told them that I have brother who work in the police in Ukraine, so, so he can provide these documents, probably. But what I can tell you, you should not just swallow instruction from your agency. If you do not agree with something or you can't uh, to do something that they ask, just tell to them how we can change uh, um, this point uh, to difference. So I think if agency is interested in your uh, personality, if they're interested to send you to job, uh, so uh, they will be more flexible. Remember, you are not slave. You are individual who have professional knowledge, who have English, and here in England, there are a lot of uh, vacancies for teacher assistant for job uh, position at school. So schools really need you. Everything will be okay. Another question was about diplomas. Uh, one of the girls asked me if school require uh, require confirm of your diploma. You know that confirm of diploma means that uh, um, one of the state organization it's uh, you need to send this diploma to them and after they check if uh, your um, diploma if your knowledge from ukraine is relevant to the british educational system i should tell no uh, no one of agencies who i 
work uh, did not ask me to confirm my diploma. They just asked me to send photo of my degree and transcription of the degree. I have no transcription because I left it in Ukraine. I took uh, just this plastic items. About payment. A small education agency, they got payment from school and after they use a different payment company, like accounting company, and this payroll company um, and this company sent your money into your account. Their payment company contact you, and you need to register the, with them. Uh, usually, you get your money uh, on the next uh, week after you work at school. For instance, if you work at school um, one week, you get your payment for this week, next week on Friday. Uh, so payment system is very simple, I think, uh, here in England. <laughs> and I like actually that uh, here in England, we don't need this future job book called Trudova Knieshka. In Ukraine, we have Trudova Knieshka. <laughs> yeah. You can work legally only on one job in Ukraine, as I understand. When you uh, go for the, uh, for the work, uh, you need to give this uh, work book uh, to your employee, and they keep it uh, during your work with them. But here in England, you can work with uh, for one job part-time job you can work in at school part-time job at um, shop part-time job and they just send money into your account and stay take uh, taxes from your um, salary дякую за увагу if you have any question you can write in comment i hope this information was helpful for you and I wish all of us good luck here in the UK. I hope that we get a good experience, new knowledge, improve our English and come back to Ukraine very soon. Glory to Ukraine, glory to heroes, to all our warriors who fight now for Ukraine and give us possibility to work and be safe. Thank you.